moving well today. Shouldn't be long before he's back on top four. Yeah. What about Charles, Edward? I didn't request a meeting to discuss Charles, John. I have another problem for you to deal with. And it'll all have to be handled very carefully. Well, if it's not Charles, who? Jan. Up already? Yes. I've decided to go to the design house before I meet Antonio Rogers. I want to make sure everyone's keeping quiet about the theft. Otherwise, the distribution deal could be off. Those templates could be in Taiwan by now. Good luck, darling. Thanks. You're going to need it. Oh, wish Leo the same for me, will you? I forgot Alan Parker was coming round. <laughs> I thought you were spending the day at the exhibition. I was just about to leave. Unless you prefer I didn't attend. No, 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 no. Did Leo get the Harding refit out? No, nope, he won't be in until lunch. Phone to say he had to deal with a personal matter. Uh, but there again, he might be up to something else altogether. Nothing would surprise me around here. All right. What's the problem? Richard Spencer, Ken. He's written to confirm he won't be racing for us next season. Yes, I'm uh, sorry. I, I should have told you. But you didn't. Well, there didn't seem any point in continuing negotiations while he was still under contract with Relton. What, so you broke off negotiations without even discussing it with me? Well, there was nothing to discuss. No? Since we've gone public, you're afraid, aren't you? Of what? Of losing control. Oh, come on, Sarah. You'd shut out anyone if there was the slightest threat. Richard Spencer, me. I am not shutting anyone out. Least of all, you. You're not interested in what I think about this company. It's only what you think. Well, of course I'm interested. You're my partner, aren't you? Why don't you treat me like one? I'm not here just to be ignored or used, Ken. I do have views on the way this company should operate, and you'd better start listening. So we're not going to achieve anything if you're engaged in this constant power struggle. That depends on the outcome. Jack called. The doctors have completed all their tests. Did they find anything? No, Avril's fine. She's regained consciousness and is expected to make a full recovery. Thank God. How was Jack? Surprised to hear me answer the phone. I'll bet. You didn't mention anything about the America's Cup meeting. I thought I'd better leave that to you. Uh, the way it reacted last time, I think I'd better choose my moment. I wouldn't leave it too long. There was also a call from Paul Sumner. Everything's progressing. They've shortlisted their team. And you're on it. Come on, girls. Smile. Look as though you're enjoying yourselves. No, it's only a rehearsal, but it's got to be right, OK? Interrupt, interrupt, look as though you like each other. That's it, use the stairs, use the stairs. That's great, lean on the balustrade, great. And pose at the bottom. And look out for the photographer, sell the frocks, sell the frocks. Somebody turn the music down before I lose my voice. Thank you. Get rid of the swing ticket. Nicola, darling, go downstairs and help with a quick change, OK? Make up! I want red lips, OK? Red. Antonia? Yes? Antonia? Oh, Jan, darling, forgive me, I'm up to my eyes. Don't tell me you're still denying it. I didn't touch the money, Mr Parker. Thirty thousand pounds just doesn't disappear into thin air. Have you asked Amanda about it? I wanted to discuss it with you first. I thought we could, let's say, reach a negotiated settlement. What do you mean, a negotiated settlement? Call off the divorce, and I'm prepared to forget the £30,000, and to add to it, another £30,000. you are trying to buy me. I prefer to think of it in terms of saving a marriage, Leo. Look, you know I was opposed to you two getting together in the first place, but now... Well, I happen to like you, Leo, and I think you're good for Amanda. 
She needs someone like you to keep her feet on the ground. 50,000. That's my final offer. 50,000, 100,000, it doesn't make any difference. It does to me, Leo. So I suggest you think about it very carefully before you finally decide. I don't need to think about it, Mr. Parker. Amanda and I made the decision to get the divorce and I'm sticking with it. The marriage didn't work. It's finished. Over. My solicitors will be in touch. Here's a little something for it. Mm. What is it? Open it, let's see. Who are these from? Um, Jan, Kate, and Leo. Hmm. And these? Tom, Relton, oh, and everyone at the yard. Oh, what about these? Charlie Freer, I suppose. How did you guess? Yeah. He's the only one who'd try and send the whole damn shop. meet Curran's deadline. Why not? Well, Anna was so exhausted getting the catalogue together, we never really caught up. When is the deadline? 14th. And when could you make it? In two weeks. 16 days at the outside. I see. And? Periplus is expanding. Once we crack Europe, we're going to need someone to handle our PR. There's no reason why that someone couldn't be you. And in the meantime? You've got a good working relationship with Koran. With your influence, you could get them to extend the deadline. Koran will have its own schedule to keep to. They can't just shut down till you're ready. They have their own deadline with the European stores, too. And if they can't deliver with your designs, they'll deliver with someone else's. Come on, Antonia. You know no one else can touch Anna's designs. That's a point in your favor, certainly. Then you'll try and help? Jan, I really can't be hopeful. Two weeks is two weeks too long. But I'll do my best. Okay? Thanks. Missed you the gallops? Oh, yes. I decided to watch Common Chera being broken instead. <laughs> you might have a long wait. Stubborn, that one. I didn't know you were interested in photography. For about a year now. Oh, Charles phoned earlier. I instructed Emerson to uh, say that you were not available. Why? Well, I didn't think you would want to speak with him. I should have thought your prime concern right now should be William. Have you heard from your lawyers? They've made initial contact. You can just imagine the response. Right. So why don't you confine your thoughts to William and forget about Charles for the moment? After all, we don't want to complicate matters, do we? Now, can I give you a lift back to the house? No, I'll stay and get a few more shots, thanks. <laughs> 